How's it going guys? I'm Josh and today I'm going to teach you how to take great photos when it's raining or been raining and everything is wet. I'm walking around Brooklyn right now. I'm going to demonstrate a few of my favorite strategies. Let's start with the reflection puddle shot. You've got great puddles building up after a big rainstorm and during and with that comes beautiful, beautiful symmetry in your photos with reflection. Notice how the lower and closer the puddle you get, the better the reflection becomes. So use a wide angle lens, get real close up in there, you're going to get some nice photos. And what loves I used to have in life, they have passed. I'll bring them back. Strategy number two when it rains, the road becomes super reflective. And when you get nice and low, you catch all that beautiful texture just sparkling in the rain. It's absolutely gorgeous. So I'm going to try and catch some bikers just biking by with the beautiful fall leaves in the background. Let's see what I get. Strategy number three, aerial pictures. Find an aerial perspective, shoot downward. Umbrellas are a beautiful shape. They're colorful and it's hard not to nail these photos. Daddy soul, come to me in times of need. Strategy number four, get some trace leches cake from your local bakery for inspiration, obviously. Can't compose good photos on empty stomach. Would you guys mind being in the photo? <laughs> Number five, take some portraits. Capture the hatred on bikers' faces as they're getting soaking wet. Capture the bored business owners who are people watching from their store. Anything and everything, don't be afraid to ask someone if you can take their portrait. Oftentimes they'll be flattered and say yes. Worst case scenario, they say no and you move on. Number six, headlights. Once it gets dark, car headlights are an amazing source of light for photos. They illuminate your subject, they silhouette them, and they cast beautiful long reflections against the street. So have fun with them. You're gonna get some killer shots shooting headlights. Tip seven, lens protection. Always have a lens hood on when you're shooting in the rain. It saves your lens from getting so much more soaked than it would otherwise. Also be sure to carry a cleaning cloth and a lens pen. Finally, number eight, be aware of how shutter speed affects the appearance of rain. So the slower your shutter speed, the more those rain droplets are gonna be dragged out, which can be a really cool looking effect, but maybe you wanna minimize that, in which case just use a faster shutter speed. And that's all I have for you today. Hope you found this video helpful and get some beautiful photos that make getting soaked to the core worthwhile. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe for more videos and I will see you eventually.